pretty cool. Throw an SD Gundam Alliance after you beat the first three missions in Directory 1. You need to essentially replay them because they have the word break there in that red rectangle. So you need to obtain the fragment keys by replaying um, and changing history. All right, so if you press right on the D-pad while selecting the mission, you have break and then you have true story. So break, I have a clear at the top and then true story, I don't have a clear at the top. So let's press A, try the true story and I'm gonna continue with my Commando Gundam. So let's launch. So I'm replaying the first mission with the true story. Essentially, obviously, it did not have the clear at the top. Um, so now it looks like Barbados or something of the sort is on my team. So now I'm going to go fight the blue Gundam instead. Video games. Alright, so it looks like now Goof is the new boss of the first mission. So Goof is the new boss of the first mission. My entire team is fighting him. I'm going to hit him with my uh, special. So, after I beat Goof, I'm going to select Directory 1B. And at the top again, you can see I have the clear for the break. And if I press right on the D-pad, I have the true story for Tekadan. So, let's try this out. Alright, I'm doing the second mission. It looks like they completely redesigned the level, which is pretty fun. We got little Gundam trucks here. So they redesigned the second level on the true history break version of it. We got little trucks, Gundam trucks. I want to push them around. Barbados is insane, dude. I feel like I'm watching Adult Swim, except in Gundam. Master Chief versus. Uh, Griff Ball bent him with his hammer. Incredible. We all love Griff Ball, remember that? That was mad fun. My friend, uh, my experience with gaming, um, after going to college online, was my one friend played Warframe for a bit. Uh, I thought that was pretty interesting. I saw a meme about, like, Destiny last night. Someone was playing, like, I don't know, it was, like, Night Story or something. And, like, it, like, loaded up, like, like, Destiny. We're not ruining your, your brand right now. Like, what are you talking about? It's like, Lance Riddick is a great actor. Your story. Oh wow. Alright, so right now I'm fighting at this huge boss right here. What's Starfield? Okay. So I've been watching Starfield recently um, by a lot of the famous streamers. Okay, let me jump on one of the programs. Get a good shot. So right now I'm fighting Ryzein. All the other Gundams are going in on him. So this game has an online co op, which is kind of cool too. So I guess you could probably fight people with, with like friends and stuff. You don't know about that kind of stuff, though. Like, from my perspective, video games are... Uh, very safe. So I just defeated the boss. I got my fragment key. You don't have to do anything with it. So I'm selecting the third mission after doing the first two true missions. So again, at the top of this thing, press left, you can see I cleared this level. And then I press right, and I didn't clear at the top. So let's select the true mission. Okay, 
So the third mission in SD Gundam Battle Alliance True History takes place at night and I have uh, Ido on my team. So well, let's continue. Ido, yoi. Alright, so the third mission, we're fighting Wing Gundam Zero, level 4. With Zero Yoi, who has the lightsaber here on your team. Pretty impressive fight. I'm gonna get some lasers at him. This is the third True History mission. Obviously, you replay the first three missions. But the new CGI, new bosses, new design, and then you unlock Correct 3 2. Okay? So, that's how that works. So bright, though. Look, look how nice the, the Gundam looks versus the brightness. Okay. So let's finish it. Finish it. So, after you complete that, you get a new mission called In the Name of G, which I guess I'll start my next stream with because first three missions are cool enough for an edit.